I tried to use some fake teeth. Yeah, don't buy fake teeth from Walmart. No. Wish I could feel what I can't see. Float like a butterfly, scream like a banshee Something's hiding in the pantry But I can't find it, so would you please Enchant me, give me a potion For my devotion Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Welcome to another video, part of my 31 days of Halloween Today's video is on this glam vampire I've always done like a bloody vampire And I wanted to do something a little more like gothic glam make sure to go and check out the Instagram posts for this look the Instagram posts are sponsored by L'Oreal so we created this look with almost all L'Oreal products but you guys in the YouTube video you'll get to see the entire look and all of the products that I used so without further ado if you want to learn how I got this look then please keep on watching Hey you guys, all right, so we're jumping right into this tutorial. My brows are done, we primed our eyes. I'm just jumping into the Tarte Tartlet palette and we're applying some shadows as transition colors. And then we are going over to this really pretty, like smoldery plum color from L'Oreal and we're applying that to the lid and blending it out. Once we've done that, I'm gonna go ahead into a pencil brush to really make sure that it's blended out in the crease of our eye. I'm using a brown eyeliner to tight line my eyes, so both the bottom and the upper lash line. And then we're winging out some winged liner. I figured this look would go perfectly with a winged liner, so I used a L'Oreal liquid, uh, liquid lipstick, <laughs> liquid eyeliner pencil to outline the top of our eyes. We're gonna apply some lashes, then we're moving on to our face. I'm applying a glow primer from L'Oreal, and then I'm going to apply a blurring primer from Cover Effects so that we can uh, have nice, smooth, shiny skin. Well, not shiny, but you know what I mean, glowy skin. <laughs> I'm applying the True Match Foundation in the color W4, and I'm just going to blend that all out. Vampires have flawless skin, you hear me? So we need to have flawless skin. I'm applying the new Overachiever Concealer from Huda and I'm just blending that out underneath my eyes and in all the highlight areas. Once we've done that, we're gonna set this whole entire look with some translucent powder. Seal it all in, baby. Seal it. Once we've done that, I'm gonna add some bronzer to my face. This is the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, one of my favorites. I'm just doing that all over. And um, then we're going over to blush. And our blush and highlights are from the new Naked Cherry Collection from Urban Decay. So once we've applied our highlight, I'm just gonna go ahead and add some of the shadow that was left on my brush underneath my eyes. I then dipped into the blush actually and created kind of like this very, very smoky under eye look that has like a lot of red in it and it just made it very vamp vampiris. Is that, is that how you say it? Is that how you say it? I don't know. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. I think that's how I say it. <laughs> and then I added some burgundy mascara from L'Oreal and then we're jumping over to the lips to kind of complete this vampy makeup look. I jumped over to my hair. So I teased the crap out of my hair. I wanted this to be just so spooky but sexy at the same time. So I'm adding the Colorista, which you guys, you see how pigmented this spray is? And it didn't leave my hair all crusty either. This was actually really awesome. So I applied some of that purple spray and it washes out in just a day. And then we applied this beautiful DIY crown and that completed our vampire look. Thanks guys so much for tuning in and watching. I truly appreciate your love, your support, and your time. If you guys try out this look, please let me know. Tag me. Hashtag me, tag the 
photo let me know I want to see it and of course give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and if you guys want to know how I got this crown make sure to check out my DIY crowns video it should either be up or it is coming it will be up this Halloween season so get ready for that. Make sure you're subscribed to me right here and click that notification bell so you make sure you don't miss out on any of my Halloween videos or, or any of my other videos that aren't Halloween videos. And of course, check out all my Halloween videos and everything else right here on the side. Thanks guys for tuning in and watching. I hope you love this look and I'll see you next time. Bye.